Well, it's about uh, 5.55 in the morning, and I have to keep my voice down about this, but there's something that I've just, I just, I, I just want to fucking say, why are you so fucking stupid? Why are you honestly so fucking stupid? Why can't you get past your bullshit in your own fucking head? And just accept shit as they fucking are. No, 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 no. You gotta be this fucking uptight, cock-sucking asshole. So, you honestly wanna know it? Why don't you... Why don't you kill yourself? Why don't you just fucking kill yourself? Just do it. Just fucking jump out of the fucking... Wherever you are and just head first. Jump. Because the world would be better the fuck without you. And you wanna know why the fuck I'm saying this? Is because you don't know who the fuck you are, but it's honestly the whole entire human fucking race. If you could just shut up for five fucking seconds and just look at the picture as it fucking is, then maybe your life wouldn't be so fucking horrible. Maybe you wouldn't be in bad fucking situations, but no, 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 no. It can't go down that way. No, no, you have to have the drama. You have to have that, 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 that thing that involves you. That, that is just special because it's about you. And no, no, you can't be happy. You can't be happy for the moment that's going on. Oh, no, 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 no. You gotta make everything fucking worse because if you make it worse, you're making it about yourself. And when you make it the fuck about your fucking self, oh, that's when it just, it just feels so great, doesn't it? It just feels so great because everybody's looking at me, at me, at me, at me. But do you know what the fucked up thing about that is about what happens when everybody fucking looks at you and you become this famous little fuckhead? Is is that, that that's the moment that everybody picks you the fuck apart and they see what you truly the fuck are. That's why you that's why you have like Bill Cosby who who's a fucking child diddler and motherfucking Jared who's a child diddler and motherfucking uh OJ Simpson who's actually maybe a fucking killer because now he's in motherfucking jail. But no 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 it wasn't it it's not it's it's either not what you see at the time because you you have these rose tinted glasses on or it's it's breaking it down because it's so horrendous in your own fucking mind that it, that it has to be expunged and most people think that it must be expunged but on an extreme on an extreme you believe that it teaches something in your head that will span to other people. So we gotta destroy it fast, man. We gotta fucking destroy it fast. We gotta come up with these new words because we got a new generation up on the way, man. We gotta make sure they're not growing up into something dark, of course. No, 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 no. We gotta make sure the walls are fucking fuzzy and and that they all have a coloring book in every fucking place that they go to because that's the safe space that we're creating. That is the fucking safe space and that space, safe space will eventually get cracks because do you know what the fuck happens when you build up and you build up and you build the fucking up? You get Donald fucking Trump. You get fucking Donald fucking Trump. America, you fucking deserve him. I mean, you got him in office. I'll admit, I didn't go vote because I don't want to. I have that right as an American. And if you don't fucking like it, fuck you for questioning my fucking rights. Fuck you. And if you honestly think about this bullshit that he's gonna come in and take your fucking rights, you, you think that Donald Trump is gonna take your rights? I mean, hell, the Republicans thought the, that Obama's administration was gonna take away rights, their gun rights, their fucking, their rights to form or speech or whatever their little demonstrations were fucking about. Well, oh, give me, oh, it's your birth certificate. That is how you're fucking acting. But you won't fucking admit that. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. You know, you can't fucking admit that. Because if you fucking admit that to yourself, you're just admitting that you are like them. You're just like everyone else. A piece of fucking shit. So put that goddamn gun in your goddamn mouth and just pull the trigger in. But the only thing that I hope is, the honest only thing that I hope is why I want you to put a gun in your fucking mouth is because I want, I want it to be empty because I don't want you to actually die. I want you to live. I want you to live so that you can live in this hell. This is fucking hell. And every fucking day, you will fucking see it until you are on fucking death's fucking door. And at that time, you will fucking realize it. Fuck you. Fuck you, motherfucker. 
That was my alarm. But anyway, you will fucking realize it. And maybe you will embrace death with sweet, sweet embrace. Or you will finally realize that you are, you are and always were nothing. You spent your life on worthless causes. And you never just enjoyed it. It had to fucking be about, quote unquote, helping people. But do you know what happens when you fucking help people? Do you honestly fucking know what happens when you help people? At that point, you're either helping, you're enabling, you're not welcome, or you think. You think that by you helping it justifies something in your mind that you never fucking did that happened a hundred fucking years ago or maybe two hundred or maybe a thousand or maybe ye eons fucking ago who really fucking knows I mean we could be in the matrix None of, nothing could be real our past all this bullshit maybe it happened maybe it didn't but in closing, I guess all I have to say is, is grow the fuck up. Because if this quote unquote war is coming, and if it comes to our shores, how many of you think will actually, how many of you actually think could survive? You, you, you think you could take trauma from war? I don't think you could. I honestly fucking don't. I don't, you can barely take the trauma of a fucking relationship that lasted uh, two months. You barely can do shit, and you and you think it's the biggest fucking thing in the world. You think they they you they they you <laughs> liking and checking into somewhere that you're actually not is helping? No, you're not helping shit. For 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 my way of thinking of what I think about the Standing Rock bullshit that I won't do divulge into because no it's no one none of that uh, and no one's business at least there's people there doing what they believe they're not on facebook they're not at parties they're not doing bullshit motherfucking just checking in like stupid dumb privileged white guilt motherfuckers that felt good i'll make more of these when i'm angry I hate everyone. Love is dead.